Humans have been advancing our knowledge for as long as we have been on Earth, and the more we learn about the inner workings of our world, the more we learn that there is to discover, and the search for new knowledge endlessly continues. Some advances are medically life-changing, while others change the way that we live our lives. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be taking a look at three cases where scientific discoveries have helped us to understand the world that we live in. Water on the Moon As scientists and researchers have continued in the push to investigate the possibility of humans eventually living on the Moon, a keystone question that has remained unanswered is the presence of water on the Moon. The Moon technically experiences day and night just like Earth, where half of the surface is being lit by the Sun while the other half is in shadow. However, the lunar days and nights are both around 14 hours long each, which, combined with the fact that the Moon lacks the thick protective atmosphere of Earth, means that water likely has a very small chance of surviving the over 400 degree temperature swing from night to day. And yet, against all odds, two years ago, water was discovered in the form of ice in the coldest and darkest regions of the Moon, where the Sun could not reach due to the natural formations of crevices and canyons in the Moon rocks, leading researchers to hypothesize that water could survive below the surface. However, the discoveries recently progressed a step further when researchers on the world's largest flying observatory, NASA's Stratospheric Observatory for Infrared Astronomy, also known as SOFIA, detected traces of molecular water on the surface within reach of the harsh sunlight. This means that water could be potentially much more widespread across the surface than previously thought. The water that was found was molecular water, which means that it is simply isolated water molecules that are spread too thin to form the liquid or ice that we are used to on Earth. Scientists don't know how the water molecules appeared on the surface of the Moon and how they managed to survive the harsh temperatures, but they speculate that micrometeorites that frequently crash into the Moon might have ejected the water molecules on impact, surrounded by glass-like remnants of the micrometeorites that protect it from the Sun. Scientists analyzing the surface of the Moon have previously found hints of possible hydration on the surface of the Moon, but were unsure as to whether it was actually water or the structurally similar molecule hydroxyl. However, the researchers on SOFIA were able to use their unique technology to observe a water molecule-specific wavelength, which no other spacecraft is designed to do in a small slice of the Moon. This creates a problem of determining how widespread these water molecules could be across the rest of the surface, as well as how it is formed, stored, and if there is any sort of water cycle with such a thin atmosphere. As much of a revelation as these discoveries are, they still leave many questions for researchers, discussing whether life on the Moon is possible in the near future, and much more research is needed to answer these questions. Scientists discover potential new organ in the throat. The human body is arguably the most widely and thoroughly studied organism known to science. Doctors and researchers are intimately familiar with the organs, bones and vasculature of our bodies and nobody ever suspected that an organ could lurk undiscovered within that well-researched minutia. However, in October 2020, scientists published a report stating that they believe that they may in fact have done just that, locating what is likely a previously unknown pair of salivary glands near the junction of the navel cavity and the throat. Currently, there are three main salivary glands, below the jaw, near the ears and underneath the tongue. But this discovery by surgeons and researchers at the Netherlands Cancer Institute proposes a fourth set of glands in the throat. They stumbled upon the structures when analyzing images of scans from an extremely sensitive machine that can recreate images of tissues in incredibly fine detail, causing the hidden organs to appear. The team then dissected cadavers for further investigation and, sure enough, discovered a pair of large glands that bear many similarities to the already known salivary glands. They were connected to large draining ducts as though to channel fluid from one place to another. If these are truly new major salivary glands, it will have huge implications for medicine, 
especially cancer treatments, as doctors take incredible care when administering radiation treatments to avoid the extremely delicate and easily damaged salivary tissues, which provide critical assistance for functions such as mouth lubrication, speaking, swallowing, sensing food, the immune system, and wound healing. Knowing where a fourth set of these major glands lies could help doctors decrease patient discomfort and damage to the body during radiation treatments. However, although several doctors and scientists have admitted that the study looks promising, others are uncertain as to whether these glands will classify as new organs. There are around 1,000 minor salivary glands scattered around respiratory passages and many of them are minuscule and tucked away in locations that make discovery via imaging difficult. This caused some peers to review the paper to suggest that the scientists have merely stumbled upon a better imaging method for these elusive minor salivary glands rather than discovering a fourth set of major salivary glands. Regardless, more study is needed as one set of clinical data is never enough to come to such a massive conclusion, and time will tell how these hidden glands will be classified. Humans grow extra artery in their arm For as long as humans have been on this earth, we have been constantly evolving from our Neanderthal ancestors to the Homo sapiens of today. Even now, with every baby born, the evolutionary trend continues, albeit in microscopically small increments that will take millions of years to be truly apparent. However, scientists studying the body throughout recent centuries have noticed an evolutionary trend that is taking hold rather quickly, and that is an increasing prevalence of humans with a third artery in their arms. A central artery develops in utero to supply blood to the distal portions of the arm but it usually disappears at around eight weeks as the fetus continues to develop and is replaced with the two radial and ulnar arteries. But occasionally, some people keep all three, and studies have shown the percentage of people who do retain the central artery is becoming larger in the population. This was first noted by autonomists in the late 1800s as cadaver dissections revealed that a predicted 10% of the population retained the third central artery. A later study found that around 30% of the population born in the late 20th century presented with the third artery, marking an astonishing evolutionary uptick as three times the amount of the population are presenting with this anatomical abnormality. This is a remarkable evolutionary increase in an incredibly short period of time, as evolutionary changes generally take thousands if not millions of years to become apparent in the population. The reason for retention is not immediately apparent, but it is suggested that it could be a genetic mutation, changing health issues in pregnant mothers or a combination of the two. Whatever the cause of the uptick in cases, researchers predict that, if current studies are accurate, then those who are born 80 years from now will almost uniformly retain the third artery. This suggests that humans may be evolving at a much faster rate than at any other point since the 1800s. This is not the only recorded example of accelerated and ongoing human evolution either. Scientists have noted an increasing trend of babies being born without wisdom teeth, and as a result with shorter faces and smaller jaws, leaving less room for teeth. Some are born with wisdom teeth, as well as the smaller jaw structure, necessitating oral surgery to remove the extra teeth as the reduced jaw size will lead to pain and crowding if the wisdom teeth are allowed to erupt. Less widespread but still notable is the increasing prevalence of babies being born with other minor anomalies such as additional bones in their arms and legs, shorter faces and abnormal connections between two or more of the many bones in their feet. These changes are collectively known as microevolution, and researchers suggest that these emerging traits could be a result of changes in natural selection and survival of the human race, as survival requires fewer specialized features and procreation is no longer a matter of survival of the fittest. Regardless of the reason, these seemingly insignificant shifts in our anatomy can ultimately lead to major structural or visual changes many generations from now, and demonstrate how unpredictable and random evolution can be, even within our own species. Sometimes the vast amount of knowledge that increasing technology and massive advances in science has allowed us to obtain can make it seem 
that we have an understanding of almost everything within our world, especially within our own bodies. However, the more details we uncover, be it within ourselves or even in the galaxy beyond our atmosphere, the more we realize how little we truly do understand the complex workings of the science behind our bodies and even our lives. Science is always growing, learning and seeking to better understand what we are made of and how we are made, and it is almost certain that we will never conclude this quest for knowledge. No matter how much we think we know, there will always be more mysteries lurking just beyond our realm of understanding. But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community whilst working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.